This is question uh, 12.4 from exercise. Uh, let's uh, read it first. Maggie Muffins Bakery generated 5 million in sales during 2016 and its year end total assets were 2.5 million. Also, at year end 2016, current liabilities were 1 million, consisting of uh, 300,000 of notes payable, 500,000 of accounts payable, and 200,000 of accruals. Looking ahead to uh, 2017, the company estimated that its assets must increase at the same rate as sales, its spontaneous liabilities will increase at the same rate as sales, its profit margin will be 7%, and its payoff ratio will be 80%. How large a sales increase can the company achieve without having to raise its funds uh, externally? That is what is its self-supporting growth rate. So we have uh, uh, 2.5 million of assets uh, because the assets have a limited uh, production capacity. So we can increase our sales to a certain level uh, by using these assets. If we have to cross that certain level of sales, uh, then we have to make some more investment into our assets. So in this example, we want to check that how much sales we can increase without uh, generating fund externally, without increasing our assets with the existing assets weight base, how much more sales we can achieve. So for this purpose, we will uh, directly go to our equation of uh, additional funds needed additional funds needed and our equation was our asset at year zero or our sales at year zero and change in sales minus our spontaneous liabilities at year zero or our sales multiplied with change in sales <coughs> minus our profit margin multiplied with next year sales and one minus our payout ratio. So what we want to know is the sales we don't have sales of next year we have sales of current year which we call as as not assets uh, we have currently 2.5 million assets just put it there and our sales of previous year was 5 million uh, we can write change in sale in the same way because we don't have uh, future sales. Then L is spontaneous liabilities. <coughs> These liabilities change uh, automatically with without our any decisions. Uh, with our working. For example, in current liabilities, notes payable, they don't increase automatically. We have to issue some note. We have to go to bank, issue notes, and these are not spontaneous. These, uh, we have to take decisions for these. While uh, our accounts payable and accruals are spontaneous. So our account payables are 500,000 while our accrual is 200,000. So our total spontaneous liabilities are 700,000 or we can write them 0 0.7 million because I am already using million. So for simplicity, 0 0.7 million and 5 million. change in sales.
profit margin is given as 7%, S1 is unknown, and uh, payout ratio is 80%. By dividing this, we will uh, get 0 0.5 change in sales minus 0 0.14 change in sales minus 0 0.014 S1. Subtract these and we will get 0 0.36. We can write change in sales as S1 minus S0, 0 0.014 S1. Open these brackets, we will have 0 0.36 S1 minus 0 0.36 S0 minus 0 0.014 S1. So now we can uh, subtract these two <coughs> and we will have 0 0.346 S1, take this to the other side, 0 0.36 S dot. Now we can solve this equation. 0 0.36 S naught is 5 million. Bring it to the other side 0 0.346 and S1. So by solving uh, this equation we will get S1 5202 312 while our S0 was 5 million by subtracting these we will have 20 2312 so this is the sales amount we can increase with our existing assets without using any external funds